all right welcome back to the channel i'm king of bad and in today's video we're trying to figure out what we're finna do because we have two we have two things that are sitting full on anarchy but i think i have to do this one because i know that other one's going to come down by two anyways and if i don't do this one now then it's just going to disappear and i'll be left with this with this district full of anarchy also the other issue comes in that i think if i don't do this mission it's going to break the the field team like level it down so i think i'm gonna have to do this one it's only one encounter so it should be a quick one too probably could have did in the last episode but oh well i need to get a level three field team soon so i can start using dragnet on situations that, that way i would have been able to get some of the money up top outbreak confirmed protect those civilians and there's gonna be shooting at civilians too so i have to keep all of those safe Minus one damage during the breach. Terminal lead again. You can use your hollow scanner. Then you nope. Actually no. Just have Zephyr lead in. And terminal bring up the rear. Go, go, go. There's two berserkers over there. And I can't remember what that dude is. But this isn't good either way. I don't know why there's still berserkers here. Who's gonna shoot? That Andrew is gonna shoot. I'm gonna go for the bruiser. I'm not liking these berserkers that are standing on guard. Land shot gives me a hundred percent chance to hit, but I'm still only gonna do four to five damage, so I wouldn't have killed it either way. And now we can take out the turret. Yeah, these berserkers are in in the thing i don't know why they have berserkers though i thought those fell into a different category for who has what on their team and there's a shit ton of enemies right are not enemies but uh civilians right by it let's see we use team up on blue bud Yeah, but use team up on blue, but he'll be able to get a few shots off. So that'll help out with some stuff going on in here. I'm gonna melee from Shadow. here, right? That freeze that enemy. Or not that enemy, but that um civilian. All the civilians are on this side is what it looks like. Yeah, it looks like every civilian is on this side. And there's currently five left. Who's gonna be next in the turnover? Number three. So I'll move down this way. I'll use Zephyr's turn to try and clear Yay. everybody out out of this area. Use Dead Eye on number two. See if you can kill them now. Okay. Stay near away from that car because it's gonna explode. And now the new number two. Can we hit them? Can we hit the new number two? Only have a 40% chance or we can do this for no reason. Pretty much. Light it up. But if that car explodes next to him, then we'd be good. cool. But it didn't go off. I don't think they're gonna be too much of a problem though. Never mind. Never mind. And now they're starting to spread out too. But as long as we can save one more, then they can't kill four of them. Yeah, these are acid grenades and she does poison spit. I forgot there was a difference in that damage. Now I'm gonna use tongue pull. I guess I can't pull any of them. And that grenade won't reach. So I'll go ahead and shoot. At them hopefully I get a look like, at crit or something since they are standing out in the open and they're poisoned or we can just graze and miss them that dude's gonna die or not you're safe cool get moving oh that dude 
Actually, I don't know who these berserkers are going for because it seems like they're not going for the civilians, especially with the way that they're moving. Let me shoot at this one because if I can land the shot on this one, then it's going to die by the poison. Yep. So it puts us back at Zephyr's turn. I'm going to have Smashing it, smash this unit. And we don't get any effects off of it yet, which I was going to say hope for an effect, but we see that that's not going to happen. So I guess we'll just have to deal with that. And can she make it to this dude to keep them safe? Transferring. Head down cool. and move. So there's only one civilian left on the board and they have to kill three for us to lose. And then we just have to clear the area. So we use dead eye here. All right, not, not the best shots on Dead Eye today, being these last two videos. Double time. I'm not I don't know what target. that weird effect was around the bullet. It was like it was some fancy shot in like Evangelion where there's a bunch of rings around the cannon or something. All right, this car's burnt out now, so we don't have to worry about it blowing up again. And we still can't tongue pull like the Berserker or anything else. We'll go for this one since we have the same chance to hit either one of them. And this is going to die with a shot. Oh, that's not good at all. Let's go ahead and heal her right back up, though. I don't think this is I think it's like two or three damage. Heal, heal, health. Or four, that's good too. And who can you see to take a shot on? You have the worst aim by far. I'm also not moving these people to be in better positions currently, but still she her aim is just bad in general. But just just mentioning it, she's just bad at shooting. She's be or not berserk. She's uh stunned. Think fast. All right, that hit. And let's see if we can hit this shot too. Yeah, cleanup crew came through and got his handled, got it all handled. So for the for the most part, that wasn't a bad mission. I don't know how many I got. What in my personal playthrough, I got two flawless flawless victories. I think so far I've only got a one in this one, which is probably going to be the only one that I think. Don't in their right mind should spend time in old town the city council says they cleared out all the old mechs have been used to send on liquidation patrols but give the whole district a pass until they hire mercenaries to hunt mechs door to door instead of bring town a local guy to city 31. there's all the tips and tricks that come out of this place our anarchy is now up to three two stuff is getting bad they imprisoned you placed you in a box ran tests all for what you were and then final indignity you the master of this world forced to swear loyalty to them they wanted your word but their own words <laughs> they mean nothing you weren't in prison it was a repatriation camp almost sounds pleasant a place for their hideous offspring to waste their summers but you you see the truth. The old world, risen from where we first drowned it. Do not adjust. Do not change. For now, you walk the bonded stair. Oh, okay. So it's stair like a staircase, but also it only says one stair. So I don't see how you can. That's just a step. There's a lot wrong with uh, the naming convention for this place, although it does seem like whatever they're trying to do is working so i guess that doesn't matter we get the region we've now unavailable to apollo interesting reflects two to four damage to any enemy melee attacker overdrive serum was pretty good too i want to get the region we first just so we can start healing people throughout the fight without having to necessarily be on them i think that's going to be a good fit for torque Hostile forces may try to sabotage infrastructure, damage crucial tech, or demolish evidence of their activities. 
Focus on any hostile attempting to destroy what you're there to protect. Hold fast and outlast their assault. But damn, both of, both of them have low health. I'll give her the region weave. And you can get the plated armor. Right. You can get a medi patch and a nano med kit. I don't have anything else to give out right now. Need to get some more weapon mods. That's the main one of the main things I should be getting. But I don't want to just buy the basic ones because I know that all the upgrades are significantly better. This water treatment plant is vital to City 31's vertical farms. Why Sacred Coil wants to sabotage it is anyone's guess. My guess? The jackasses. It sounds about right. Uh, Elijah Luther's engine just sees an extra action point. We have two encounters here. We'll have terminal on a terminal torque go last and get the extra action point. And as long as I don't forget, then I'll be able to do I'll be able to move poison spit. Tongue pull and bind. Who is this? Go for the turret because we don't want to get any shots uh, our way. At least not for free. They can use a turn to do it. Can't use poison spit. There's a dude right there though. If we can see them, we should be able to spit it on them, right? Maybe there's a range dif dif difference. Maybe there's a range thing applied to it. What I say? We could. Why is it? Oh, she having she has an extra action at the top. All right. Well, I guess we can just. Uh, where's the number two thing? Can we tongue pull that? What can we, what enemies can we tongue pull? That's the question. Doesn't look like it. That thing's gonna be immune to the poison. Ooh, hit my mic. Wow, already starting that back up. Let's just take them out then. Hostile no longer exists. Now we have him with his dead eye. That's not a good shot for it, but it is a free shot essentially. Ooh. Oh, that was a weird little stretch going on. That's yeah, his body got like ripped. It's like a cord is pulling his body, but also that's like a leg joint. Anyways. You can't see anyone from here. That's gonna hit the civilian. Let's just uh let's move up. Move to here. I need a better angle. He's gonna be an Overwatch also, so whenever that number three D tries to move, he's gonna get shot at. I don't think we get any effects off this chaining jolt either. Although it definitely gets powerful later in the game, especially when you can increase the chaining range. Only three damage. Redeeming prey. Oh, but they can't see. Okay. I guess the little ring effect was always there. Just never noticed it. You subdue on them. Another collar for the medic. Can you uh, tongue pull the enemy from here? No. You should be able to do it from here. Exercise. If you can't from here, then there's a problem. Honestly. Make it. Tongue pull on the enemy. Still only 86% chance that also Your missed side. somehow. We were getting a lot of, I think I was playing by myself, but we missed on a 95% chance to shoot. So they really let that 5% and 16 show. I don't care about the dead eye miss as much as like a normal shot miss. The dead eye is just extra damage that he consistently gets. Locate the control computer. That's the last thing we have to do here. Security feed shows a bunch of sacred coil ahead of you. That's a lot of pipes, so 
careful where you shoot. Uh, how many sacred coil in a bunch? Uh, more than five, less than 30. Oh, I was hoping for a nice round number. And I was hoping for a better security feed, yet here we are. Yeah. I don't know what, uh, shit, I can't remember. I didn't remember what his name is. Less unit gets armor. Patrick's going second for this. So we'll do terminal and torque with the armor because she's probably going to be binding a lot of units. I don't know if we can bind the. Oops, did it again. I don't know if we can bind the, the Andromeda, but I'm pretty sure we encounter quite a few in this mission. I just remember that from previous playthroughs. We have a good chance to crit here. If we do a kill. Then we'll go ahead and use the second shot and take them out. And then start spreading damage. They're, the way their body felt was just completely unnatural. They have neonate chrysalids. Or they have chrysalids period, which I forgot about. And cool. Alright. Sacred coil reinforcements en route. Keep them from draining those tanks. Smashing Andromedons is so calming. Anyone else? Why is she no? against Andromeda? Fine, you're lost. Miss. Ted's not in the game. Yeah, he's really out of it today. Wow, that's a big miss. I'm not really planning these shots out, so I don't. Yeah, I don't know why I was taking those shots. I probably should have moved him around first. Oh shit, I should have looked at look for the defender too. Yeah, I really messing up. I was just playing the game in that position and not doing stuff necessarily if that makes sense. We can get him into here. There's a shot on the uh one to nine. Where does that explosive go? It's right there in front of us. Don't want to dash her anyway. Because I do still want to have a move right after this. Okay. The explosion is next to Torque. Where is this dude at? What's our chance to hit them? 70? That's not bad. Damn, we are not hitting shit today. Ah. Uh, yeah. He's going to take on... And that's going to turn into a, a something if we don't stop it either. Yeah, let's just shoot at that thing. Why are we missing everything? I don't think anything's hit so far. Enough of that, jackass. I was going to say that's what you get for missing, but that's still don't not a positive for me. Bad. She has to move out of this fire before she can do anything for real. She has to not be burning before she can do anything also. All she can do is shoot or burn right now. Let's get some of these crystals off the board if we can hit something. They don't have a lot of health. They're just kind of all over the place. All right, we can use Blue Blood's Dead Eye here. Heads up. What is, what's, what's happening? Everything's he had a 70% chance on that and it still misses. Nothing is falling today. I'll take it. I guess it's time to take Blue Blood off of the team. I assume there's some sort of like tire out that characters can get. I'm just gonna assume that's, that's what's happening and not all of my characters just can't hit anything today. Alright, he's not doing anything on his turn. Alright, cool. That's a sneeze. Um, this? I don't think that instantly is gonna get rid of the other thing that's sitting right there. And I do have to get rid of that because I think it's gonna continue to spawn chrysalids. Where's it going? 
Oh, okay. You're lucky I don't bruise. It's all right. You can manage. Uh, let's heal her first. And I don't think there's a point in you. Well, I can use subdue just to kill them and then use torque to take out the other one. And then use torque to take this one out. Why don't you lie down my bed? Now what can we see with dead eye? I don't, I don't know why I'm still that trying to shot. Me. Obviously he's not doing anything with it. He should have like he got a star on his uh aim. Clearing the way. I definitely should have moved them uh, sooner. I don't know. Oh, so you can use the flamethrower on them too? Yeah. That stings. What's the the guardian at too? Because I just realized he's still over here with no damage taken. Probably should have moved patchwork before I did that though. But oh well, at this point. And I forgot to take this thing out. Okay, it's broken now, so I don't have to worry about it anymore. Okay, that hurt. Don't die, I guess. You subdue to get a movement and get over to here. As well as taking them out. And she's immune to the fire, so she was fine the whole time. So she could actually stay there. Move behind this dude and just bind him. I do believe we can do that? Yep. Which will take them out. Weapons running low. Yeah, it's because you missed literally everything in it. Did we do the last shot thing? I can't remember. Let's move him over to here and try and get a clean shot on this guardian, though. 99% chance to hit. I was gonna say, if you miss this the one, Pray to the slaughter. and I never put her in a good position. Um, but you can use a make it on yourself. Spread you out over to here. Going to move. That's it. And you don't have a clear shot on anything except for teammates now. You can just, uh, I guess you can overwatch over here. I don't think that guardian's gonna get any closer. He doesn't seem to be moving at all. Watching for hostiles. 73% chance to hit here. Let's go for it. Cool. Take that. Now I know we're gonna be in an you. onslaught for three ways. Uh, is she burning and then have to release the bind? Is that what happened? That's fine. I'll just use uh subdue. I didn't mean to move it do it from there, but shame you didn't resist. Either way. Out of ammo. Gonna reload. Good to go. Then use Overwatch on this entrance. Patrick can use Overwatch over on this entrance. It doesn't it's not giving me like the range of her Overwatch right now. Or like the squares on where she's gonna be able to see. Never even saw this entrance. I don't think this even they even used it last time. But we did only get two units, so that's not too bad. Who needs healing? You do. Let the high tech spray do its work. Now the question is, can we bind an Andromeda? I don't even think we can pull an Andromeda, to be honest. They walk around in metal suits filled with argon, I believe is the gas that's Better filled with them, that they breathe. You do good work. She's still burning, but she also gains two health every time. So the burn is not doing anything to her. Yeah, we can only tongue pull enemies or the teammates, or we can shoot at the Andromeda. Which I don't want to be in a clear line of sight for at all. So I'm gonna move over to here. Hopefully that gives me cover from the Andromeda, but not block my line of shot. My line of shot, line of fire. Cool. 
miss? No, okay. Knocked a few scales off. And we still can't bind it either. Can that's not good. Okay. I use dead eye on them. Alright. Don't know why I'm still trying dead eye. That 82% chance obviously means nothing for me right now. Um, I guess I just shoot at the Andromeda. I was hoping that the dead eye would hit. If, the, if dead eye hit, it took it out. I would have been able to reprogram the Andromeda's body. We had another Andromeda and another Android coming in. Does anyone else need to heal? She does. For this yeah she need you need it though yeah, though i think the andromeda just drop poison uh when they walk and not acid if that's true and nothing is hitting still if the andromedas do drop acid and not all right drop poison and not acid then it'll be fine we have this acid grenade that we can drop on something let's get it over Bring there it Cause it could get an acid burn, but either way, it did shred that armor off. Just shoot at this thing. Fire weapon. It didn't tell me exactly how much damage it was gonna do. Is no okay. Blood on my jacket Ugh, again. I think she said that in the last thing. Do I want to take the We're shot here, again? What's my chances on the other dude? I'm gonna take this 81% chance. Because he couldn't hit that 82 earlier. Is this lance shot lined up to hit both of them? It absolutely is. Who's in the way? Because they might get shot anyways. Oh no, the thing that we're supposed to protect is in the way. Protect the control computer. Yeah, Daphne was gonna take that out. Almost still shot it too, because I thought it was a teammate and not the actual thing we're here, here to do. Four to five will kill this thing no matter what. That thing has an acid burn now, which is pretty good. We can go for a reprogram on it too. Looks like we got it. Melting hardware. Next time just shoot. And now we can shoot too. We can still do that also. And with hundred percent accuracy. So that's pretty good. We're doing good so far. It's a good thing that they're coming in this area where there's already acid all over the place. It looks like the Andromeda can't get acid. <gasps> Excuse me. Acid burns. Empty. Oh, shit. You're almost dead yourself. Didn't even notice that at first. Who's next? Number four Andromeda is next. I think I'm going to go for this one, though. It's right in our face and right by what we're trying to protect as well. He said she doesn't have enough ammo. Let's drop this right here. And then I'm gonna have her move into it. On the go. That's what she'll be for now. You can use that out here with 81% chance. Check it out. And then I'm gonna move closer because he's way too far away from this fight. Moving. Now that we know Eyes that nothing's open. coming in from that corner, we don't have to protect Another it as much. I don't think anything's ever coming through that corner. Cool. Yeah, okay, cool. Angel was killed. It's fine. Oh yeah, I was acid burn because it came in and ammo. immediately did that. Uh, you can reload. One moment, reloading. And use chaining jolt on that android and take it out. So I think it's gonna kill it completely, fuses. right? Yep. Because it does a bonus of two damage to Great. uh I'm robotic out. enemies. She's out. You can reload. I think we're Better safe where what? we are for now, and then take the shot. 
I'm gonna break this thing shell before we get to uh before we get to patchwork's turn again that way she can use her shock and deal six damage instead of just the normal four which we're able to do easily i'm nearly dry he has the free reload who has the free reload no we didn't have a we don't have an auto loader can you see them from here with that eye yeah let's do that and then move to where uh he has a clear shot with overwatch if they move, it looks like that won't matter either since we have her chaining jolt that doesn't miss that thing only has two health which is the bonus damage that we do so it was dead either way Uh, from what we can tell, Sacred Coil took advantage of power struggle. Andromeda in fighting, which sounds like the premise of an old world reality show, is how Sacred Coil convinced these Andromedons to go rogue and sabotage the city's food supply. Today proved that they were unreliable allies. Sacred Coil exper experiment with Andromeda saboteurs is over. Cool. I don't think that's the end of Andromeda though. I think they still come back later on for some stuff. In, in one word, can you describe the city council's relationship with the Andromeda Sanctuary? Essential. I try. Not in one word, but there's a human phrase that best sums it up. A real shit show. Close enough. Channel 37's interview, 2039 Mayor, Mayor? May, <laughs> May 4th. City 31's Andromedon Sanctuary passed along their gratitude for how you handled the situation. Great work. We did pick up another scar on uh, Terminal, which I wasn't paying attention to. Or I wasn't paying attention to our health throughout the uh, fight, so that's on me. Hairpin trigger scope ap rounds we already have ap rounds we don't need more of those the scope we definitely should pick up the upgrade added aim bonus to any weapon it is attached to i never really used the hairpin trigger because that's it only has that 10 percent chance so if i put it on there it's not it's not very likely to do that then we go for this little one and then go for became the world's only source of androids after retooling advent mech factories sacred coil has been sniffing around there for the past week find out why uh yeah i'm gonna take the that well actually i'm just gonna wait and do that because i don't have any uh any of the blue things the situations so i'll have to go in and do something anyway so i'm gonna reload at this point Hopefully I remember to like check out the shops and stuff, but that's going to be all for this video and for today's recording. Uh, I'll see y'all next time. Bye.